Aloha and welcome. My name is Taylor Norris, and I am so grateful to be a galactic astrology soul reader and Reiki master teacher. In today's video, I'm going to try to make this short as I do plan to do another video on the upcoming Pisces lunar eclipse, but I just wanted to share with you the last lunar eclipse that we had in Pisces that was at a similar degree point. So I'm going to share my screen and show you that and also tell you a bit of a personal story with a very special message that I hope will reach the right person or the right people at this time that really comes from my pure heart, my soul. And yeah, so let me share my screen with you. Okay, so on September 16th, 2016, we had a full moon in Pisces. So this was a lunar eclipse at 24 degrees and 20 minutes of Pisces. So it was about a degree, a little over a degree off the lunar eclipse we're coming up on, but it, it's in a very similar area of your chart. So I invite you to reflect on what was happening for you in September of 2016, around that month, the next six months, and even leading into it. But, you know, I invite you, if you have a diary or a journal, look back, read, if you have a phone with pictures, with videos, if you have a phone, of course you have a phone, but look back on your phone at photos, any videos you might have taken around that time. Great time to reflect and and see and and hopefully see how much you have grown since then. So I say this and I share this with you because I did this myself this morning. I went on my phone and I looked at photos from this time and I found a video that I recorded of myself about a week after this eclipse. And I'm going to stop my share and just was pretty shocked at what I saw. Really, really. It was like, it was a video of myself, but it was like watching another person or someone like a, like a long lost sibling where I could see the resemblance and like know we're related somehow. But it was that the energy, this was my lowest point in nine years, for sure. If I go further back in my life, there are unfortunately even lower points, but this was a very low point. And watching this video, you know, I thought about maybe I'd share some of it here, but I really want to protect that version of myself's privacy and safety because she was brave enough and courageous enough to get on camera and record a video and not share anywhere but to to document it and I even said that in the video that version of me did and this was a video I recorded before I had taken my first Reiki class and I just want to share this message with anybody who has yet to find something that greatly improves the quality of your life and continuously and exponentially improves the quality of your life. That if you have not tried Reiki, then I would certainly invite you to take a Reiki class. I wish that myself uh, in 2016 was able to take a Reiki class then, but I know the divine timing and the divine order of everything was such that 
I had not yet made that decision and taken that class. So I want to share with you, maybe to somebody who's out there and thinking about a class, I'm teaching a class during this Eclipse Portal, September 28th, 29th. So you're welcome to take Reiki 1 and 2 with me or take with another teacher or have a Reiki session or engage with the energy just gotta share this. I really felt so compelled because the difference in my frequency in my life at that time, you know, I don't want to go into a bunch of personal details, but I had created a reality for myself that I did not like at all, that I really hated. And the best way to to describe it was for me, it was like a personal hell realm that I was living in. And to fast forward to my reality now where I'm living in my dream home, I'm living in my dream location, I get to do this work that I love so much and I'm so passionate about that makes use of my very unique and authentic gifts and talents and skill set connecting with the most incredible people all over the world all the time in these sacred circles in these safe spaces in these incredible sessions and readings and really just enjoying a very simple stable peaceful loving life that maybe doesn't look glamorous or flashy to other people or you know, look like the most successful to somebody else. But for me, it fits and it feels good. And it feels like heaven on earth for me. And that's what counts. So I just want to come on here and share that and like offer that invitation to you that this video is for you. I know many who watch my channel are already Reiki practitioners, already Reiki attuned. You guys know what I'm talking about, how amazing Reiki is. But for somebody who's out there who's really struggling and is ready to try a different approach and, you know, this version of myself in 2016 was very spiritual, you know, was doing a lot of the right things, yoga, meditation, visualization, chanting, mantra, other types of energy work kundalini yoga i had awakened my third eye and my intuition quite a bit i was having powerful dreams night terrors is what i was commenting on in this for particular video you know i was considering getting an etheric surgery like an energy healing surgery and i'm actually really glad that i didn't <laughs> It didn't work out and this was very positive, you know, but I was doing a lot of the right things and really trying and and showing up and, and committing and in support groups and things too. So, you know, if you've tried a whole lot and you've you feel like, gosh, some things I just maybe they can't be healed, I'm here to tell you that my life improved dramatically beyond my wildest dreams, positive dreams. And I'm so very grateful to Reiki. After watching this video I'm finishing my yoga asana practice in the morning, you know, I did a Reiki journey for myself and enchanted and drummed and cried because I'm so grateful. And I actually went outside and there was a huge rainbow in the sky, you know, like... It was like, see, look, I work. This is real. This is real. It's so real. So I invite you to reflect on where you were at September 2016 Consider Reiki as a way to support yourself and raise your frequency and not just raise your frequency you know, you f to feel better. I certainly feel so much better in every level of my being so much more aligned, but really have seen my life, my quality of life, every aspect of my life improve greatly. So I just wanted to come on here and share that. And I think I will wrap up this video. 
I do plan to make another video on the lunar eclipse, but I'm just so grateful for Reiki. I'm so grateful for having this channel, this place where I can express myself and so grateful for my willingness to evolve, your willingness to evolve. And I really hope this message reaches the right people. If you know someone who maybe could benefit from hearing this message, then please share it with them. Sending you so much love, so much gratitude, light and hope and peace. Aho, amen, namaste, so it is, mahalo.